Hey everyone, don't forget to use code Nevit in the Epic Store. Thanks for watching. What's up everybody, new video today, and I'm going to show you how to green screen any animation you want from Fortnite, so that you guys can make your own notifications or videos. Okay, so when you get on Fortnite, you need to go to Creative. So when you finally get on the Fortnite Creative, you're going to have to open up a new portal, and you're going to use this code here. This is for a green screen room, so it's going to make it really easy to record stuff. So when you get into the map, you're going to have to jump down a couple floors before you actually get to the green room. Alright, so once you finally hit the green room, you're just going to run to the furthest wall, turn around and face the exit. And at this point, you're just going to use whatever emotes, dances, skins you want in the green screen. So now open any recording software you have, it doesn't matter what it is, I use Streamlabs OBS personally. Now go to career and load up the replay of the creative match you just did. Here's a clip I made earlier that's a really good example of where the replay camera should be before you start recording. So when you're happy with your replay and you're ready to record, go back to your software and just record the screen as is with the green screen in the background. I usually do about 30 seconds. If you need to, you can use software like DaVinci to cut up the clip and cut out impurities and make it shorter if you need to. Now go into OBS and add two media sources. One is going to be for the green screen animation and one is going to be for a background. Once you have your green screen clip and a background up, what you want to do is you want to right click on your green screen clip and you want to put a filter on it. You want to add a chroma key. For all the chroma key settings, just use default because it's fine for this. And there you go. Once you've actually just taken away the background with the chroma key, you can just put your character wherever you want on your background, or you can do it on your stream, or you can make a notification, or add it to your videos. Do whatever you guys like. Alright, and that's it. I really hope this tutorial helped everyone. Uh, let me know in the comments below if it did. And as always, thanks everybody for watching. If you haven't, please like, share, and subscribe.